Hello everyone, I hope you all are fine and having fun with your lives. Today I am going to share a new Proteus library which I named as Vibration Sensor Library for Proteus. In this library I have designed a vibration sensor whose code is SW420. This vibration sensor is named as SW420. The link of this tutorial is given in the description of this video and when you click that link you will come to this tutorial on our blog vibration sensor library for OTS. From this tutorial you can download the, this library and can simulate your vibration sensor in OTS. These are different libraries which I have already designed Arduino, Genino, GPS, XB, Ultrasonic, PIR and Bluetooth libraries. So you can download the vibration sensor library from here and when you click it you will get a file to download. Click start download, open it and in this zip file you will find a folder vibration sensor library for Proteus. Here you have Proteus simulation and library files. You need to upload these library files, extract these library files in the library folder of your Proteus software. So I'm gonna browse to Lab Center, Electronics, Proteus 7 Professional and Library and click OK. It will replace all my file and I am clicking yes to all. Now you have placed all your files in the <coughs> library folder of your Proteus software. Now here the Proteus simulation. What you need to do is to open it and when you open it It would seem like something as shown here. So here is our vibration sensor which is SW420. When you double click it, here is our path program file where you need to upload the PIR sensor TEP dot. Sorry, this is the wrong file. You have to upload. Yeah, you have to upload this file, library file, payartsensortp.x and click OK. Now, when you play it, it will show, uh, when the test pin is high, it will be, it's like, it's the vibration sensor is detecting the vibration. Because we can't produce the actual vibration in the protein environment, so I have used this test pin as an indication. So when you take it high, then it means the sensor is sensing the vibration and that's why its out pin is high and our LED is on and if you make it zero it means that there's no vibration in the environment and our out pin is low or grounded so that's how you can simulate your vibration sensor in Proteus high and low thanks for watching subscribe to our youtube channel take care bye bye